<laughs> it's hopeless, John. They burnt down the police station, and they're not even up there. Where else could they be? I don't know, but our best chance is to just look out for more crimes in the city. Hey, are you sure there's not a second floor to the factory? Well, there is, but there's nothing but gears and pipes up there. There's no, not even access. Then it's hopeless. All right, dude. Let's just get look be on the lookout for any suspicious activity that might involve this, you know? Other than that, I can't tell you what to do, dude. I mean, yeah, I get it. We just have to let it be. <laughs> huh? All right. We didn't just burn the police station down in a flash. This is not the end of our plan, and now Chase is on our tail. And they've even got my friend. He's the only person I can really trust out of you guys, and now we really need help. Got any ideas? Chase doesn't know that we're here. We could use that to our advantage. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. It's just if we go anywhere, he's going to have his sharpest eye out for us. So we have to be careful. Yeah. But first, I think we need to save our pal. The longer he stays in Chase's custody, the worse. Yeah, that's a really good idea. But the thing is, how are we going to do it? Hmm, that's really tough. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> All right, dude. I think I've got it. Give me your clothes. What? No, I've already given you more information than I can tell. Plus, I really don't want to be helping you. So I don't want to give you my clothes. You'll just be making everything worse for my organization. Give me your clothes right now. <laughs> Oh, I get it. It's like a disguise. You're pretending to be a robber when you're really not so that the robbers don't know that you're you. Exactly. <gasps> I just remembered. What? I have my tracking locator on my wristband. Really? <gasps> I knew it! I think we've got this case cracked. <laughs>